This particular video will briefly highlight the topic of fair weather friend. Not every friend is a soulmate, and that's where the idiom fair weather friend plays its part. Fair weather literally refers to mild weather. Therefore, idiomatically, it duly describes a companion of favorable weather. In times of harsh weather, he is nowhere to be spotted, or at least not as a friend. Hence, they can also be referred to as clear weather friend, or lastly, a sunny day friend. Such type of friends are only interested in one's wealth. They do more of talking and taking and avoid giving. Due to their fawning ability, fair weather friends remain disguised. However, a firm contemplation is quite efficient in identifying them. To do this, recall your time with the suspected fellow and analyze if he avoided to discuss about your problems in an irrelevant and offensive manner. Then, candidly answer the following questions. Does he respect your emotions? Does he use you for his own interest and never come to you for help? It is crucial to pinpoint a clear weather friend to save yourself from mishaps and worse, becoming a fair weather friend yourself. Succeeding paragraph will clarify this. According to a survey, the self-centered and loathsome personalities are a result of adversities. Hardships and betrayals make them rebellious and cause them to think only about themselves. Similar is the situation shared by a 22-year-old adult from Los Angeles in the Guardian paper. In the story, she mentions a friend with whom she shared not only her clothes and abode, but also a personal diary. Despite of this much close affection, she was dished by her sunny day friend upon finding a prosperous guy. The narrator had later found out that her so-called friend's dad had committed suicide and since then she had been searching for support in others. The writer has associated this behavior with a disguise for survival. But people should know that their demands cannot be satisfied by others. They need to be self-dependent. There are various movie productions which shower light on such friends and their consequence. One such production is the American movie San Andreas about an earthquake. There comes a scene in the film where Black is stuck in a car in basement of a building. At first, her stepfather finds it convenient to help her out but later re realizes that this will bring down his own life at stake and abandons her. Whereas it turns out that Black is more knowledgeable about how to act in the case of natural disasters. Once helped by her true friend out, Black guides them to survive the earthquake. On the other hand, Black's stepdad dies ruthlessly in the calamity. This highlights that we should not adapt such callous way to face our problems otherwise our end will not be better than our actions. It is not possible to live with complaints deep within ourselves. Therefore, it is important to decide what to do about your friendship with the fair weather friend. Think about it. Is it possible to change your friend's personality with cons counseling? If not, make a mindset to end the friendship in the most appropriate way, either by saying it way away directly or gradually by making excuses to maintain distance. To conclude, fair weather friends are self-centered and bogus. They are that way mostly because they have initially been betrayed by life and have grown rebellious. However, they do not have a happy ending or are left with despair. It is better to end this type of friendship as soon as possible to avert from tra tragedy. Thank you.